I hope everyone is staying healthy at home. I've just gone back to Australia, so that means we do have to self-isolate and quarantine for an additional two weeks. This will actually be the longest time that I've taken off the ice since I started skating when I was eight years old. Uh, by the time I actually get back on the ice, I would have been off for about three weeks. So here is a quick workout that you can do at home that involves absolutely no equipment. With this workout, we are doing a combination of legs, glutes, and core. And I am not a personal trainer or anything. These exercises are personally just what works for me and they're the ones that I enjoy doing. So yeah, let's get into it. So we'll be doing two to three rounds of everything. You can either do two or three, depends how much you wanna do. In between each round will be a 45 second break. There is a total of 10 exercises. So with each exercise, we're gonna do 40 seconds on and then in between each exercise, we're gonna have a 15 second break. Three of those exercises are ones that involve alternating feet. So you're gonna do one foot and then switch the other foot. In between changing those feet, you won't have the 15 second break. We're just gonna get straight on into the other foot. So in total, it will be 14 sets of exercises and then that's round one. And then we have a 45 second break and repeat all over again. I hope that makes sense. So each round is 14 sets. <laughs> Okay, so first exercise is Bulgarian split squat. So if you've just got a lounge, a little table, if you can use a plyo box if you want. Back leg up, you take a wide stance so that your knee doesn't go over your toe. Next exercise is side lunges. So with any lunges and squats, what we want to do, we want to make sure that our knee doesn't go over our toes. So when we're stepping sideways, we still want to take a wide enough step out so that our knees are right over our toes and they don't go past it, okay? Here, this is another alternating one. You should just go out like this. See how I'm sticking my butt out? And then up again, and then repeat. We're going to do a glute bridge. This is also an alternating exercise because we're going to do it with the leg up and then we're going to switch legs, okay? So you need to keep your core engaged. Make sure your hips are not wobbling like this. Try and keep them as straight as possible. Next exercise is side leg lifts. Lie down on the side, bottom leg bent, top leg straight. You're just gonna lift the leg and put it back down. Make sure that you don't open this hip. We wanna lift like this and keep our hip forward, not open our hip, okay? Okay, so our final leg exercise until we move on to core. So our last one, Squat to squat pulse. I was just gonna do squat pulses, but then it's kind of better when you have like a booty band around your knees. So we're gonna do two squats to five squat pulses. Knees shoulder width apart, make sure your knees don't go over your toes. So two squats, one, push your hips forward, two, then we're gonna do five squat pulses. So these, staying low, and then etc. etc. Somebody come get her, she dancing like a creeper. <laughs> Somebody come get her, she dancing like this. Legs are done now. Now for our core, we're gonna do mountain climbers first, play position, and then just drive your knees towards your chest, okay? Back 
Okay, so final exercise of the whole round, leg downs with a lift. We're gonna put our hands under our butt slash lower back just to stop spinal flexion. And so everything's engaged because if we start wobbling around like this, it's gonna hurt our spine. We're gonna go down and up and a lift. Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. Let me know if you liked it. Let me know what other videos you want to see. Make sure you like this video and subscribe to my channel. I hope you stay healthy. I hope you stay happy. And make sure you check out the rest of my videos.